great assist teams. They're third in assists, and the Raptors get into the paint a ton. Fourth in the league in points in the paint. Moody, elbow jumper, so Moses Moody back it in the beginning. Clay Thompson scoop shot, and he just couldn't figure out which way he wanted to finish. Quickly for three, and Steve Kerr's going to be a little push shot by Draymond. And right now, you need someone other than Moody to score. R.J. Barrett, corner three. This is kind of how Steve's get through. Trying to drive it. Draymond's got some quickness. Saw Draymond in, in the gym today. This man quite intentional about his fitness. Well, if you look at January 15th when he returned, everything good with the Warriors on offense because of J.K.'s play. So I'm giving him credit. I'm giving J.K. credit. When Wiggins is playing well. That was big, too. Scotty Barnes hit the three. First quarter. Steph Curry, a good look. The Warriors needed that. Chad Jr. couldn't get around that well enough to contest. Barrett on the step through. So he's been hitting three there. Didn't get a whistle. Quickly pushing it back the other way. Got to get out here. And Barnes made one, but Hurdle. The Warriors just aren't moving as fast as the Toronto Raptors are right now. Bad transition defense there. Steph Curry. He can keep me in the area. But when he was introduced, it felt like we were at Chase Center. So loud. Steph to Draymond, little push shot, perfect. And had a couple buckets there. It was important. Looney checking in now. That's his Chris Paul. Steph, how hot am I? He hits. Then he's going to work on Looney. Shot clock at three. Bruce Brown, a little push shot. Here come the Raptors right back. That's such a hard shot. Olenek right to the rim. He knows they want to run him off the three. The Raptors are vulnerable is inside, inside that restricted circle. Correct. So you can get in there. Only missing the jumper, but GP2 tipping it in. That's one. GP2 just hanging around the baseline. You hit on a K. You don't want to settle for threes against this team if you don't have to. Aaron can break down the lane. Oh, Lennox sniffed it out. He said, I've seen some highlights of that Trace Jackson Davis youngster. Scotty Barnes scoring. Shot clock at seven. Pinona's on a good defender, Bruce Brown. And then Sharon's nice delivery to GP2. Yeah, That's where you see Dario sick at seven. Skip pass to Grady Dick. Scotty Barnes with the shot clock at three. Takes the big step and flips it home. And that's where you just see Dario on Bruce Brown. Brown plays a lot like GP2 as a little big man. They want to get Dario going again, though. And banks it in. And Chris Paul top. They got good vibes playing the Warriors. Yeah, Trace came to double because Quinones needed help on Scotty Barnes. And Olenek hitting the three. That's the problem. They got Moses Moody back in for the Dubs. Grady Dick. I think Grady Dick's got some game. Baller probably a little quicker than Grady Dick, but Grady Dick was not taking no for an answer. Yeah, 13th pick in the draft, taken by Toronto. Out of Kansas. Moses Moody's got 10. First oh. Grady Dick. Didn't get enough contact to get the whistle on the drive. Here comes Dick the other way. Steps into the three. And you can see he, he's a Moody reverses it with a skip back. Sharich at two. Chris Paul, three at the shot clock buzzer, and he got it. Knew exactly how the speedy substitution can infuse some energy and some speed into the Warriors. I like it. Here's your ball screen. Kaminga down the lane. Kaminga to serve at home. It works so well. Close out the Knicks last night. Another step ball screen here. Kaminga's first field goal tonight. Kaminga's able to turn the corner. Barrett, his assist numbers the last five games have been excellent. This looks so comfortable here. Very Pirtle with the rebound. Jakob Pirtle, his second tour of duty with Toronto. And they got a lot of shooters. But gave him just a little airspace. That's all that Gary Trent Jr. needs. Both teams have made eight threes. Bingo. Oh, my oh, he climbed Mount Pirtle. So they keep using that step ball screen. It works so well. Grady Dick, a lot of contact there, and Pirtle dropping in. We have had, and I'll especially the Warriors, the way they want to play, not choppy. Oh, no, Kaminga down the lane, and this time he is fouled. He got one. He was begging for the foul. 
The last it's more powerful than him but in the league, attacking the rim. You can talk about LeBron James. Zion, like Zion. I mean, that's there, it's a when you in positions where you can score, get downhill. Quickly couldn't get by Clay. Olenek. And that was a good post up. His footwork is so good. There's no time to recover. There isn't a team in the league that wouldn't want Kelly Olenek. Eight points, three rebounds, two assists, and another three. Moody quickly made up for it. It's a five on four. Linick is down and behind the play. That's a bruise. And Kaminga dropping it to Moody. And Moody tips it in. Coming off his best defensive game, maybe of his career last night. And it's the offense. And Junior. You see those shoulders up to the Mac. Yeah, from deep. Come on now. And Curry's got four threes. Not seeing defenders in the way. Quickly missing the three. To the Raptors' credit, they've gotten their hands active. Moody saying, I'm going to go around. Aaron airballs that three. So take advantage while Toronto's cooled off a little bit. And Curry from deep. Well, even though he ran him off the three point line, he's got that floater just making a tough shot at least. They are. That, the last 15 games look like the Warriors. They're, they're just fighting. It, it doesn't have to be a pretty game. Red Jr. Split action. All the marquee Warrior plays. They, they dare to make it a shoot threes because he's been killing them inside. And Clay works inside. Sometime you saw him, so you're thinking, hey, well, I don't get in RJ Barry. He's making everything except free throws. Well, that's one. Welcome to the NBA. Second free throw in, tied at 71. Kaminga scoring! Oh, man! The opportunity for the Dubs to have this advantage. And trailing most of the game. There you go. Kaminga's, Kaminga's inside to lay it up and in. He was posting up Gary Trent Jr., who we were Warriors back. Early in the season, their transition defense was completely lacking. So that was the next thing. The Warriors have improved here lately. So it's an 8-1 run. Biggest lead of the night. Bashi didn't want the baseline shot. And that's a nice fit. Everything. Warriors love to get some separation here now. Now nine in the first half. Grind it within three. And their first double-digit lead. About Toronto's points in the paint, 38. But the Warriors, 34. Grace Jackson Davis dropping in the first free. Remember, two tacos a day keeps the hangry away. Download the Jack app and get them for 99 cents. Half court, if they see they're missing, guys are going to get more aggressive on the board. So just continue to box out, put bodies on people, keep the physical. Yeah, they had a goofy travel situation, but they're playing so well that they're, they're, they're just at a competitive level. In that pick and roll. Boucher's got some length, just throw it up there. Bruce Brown trying to slow down. Chris Paul. He got shooters crossing pass. And yeah, he's, he's enjoying his time here. So Trace, three of four. Desi Justice. Well, they got a, a good amount of guys that can move it off the ball. They're definitely one of them. They're one of the better cutting groups. But, but that's Coach Ryakovich because international basketball and kind of Serbian basketball. We, we talk about Croatia. Shot clock at 10. Chris Paul gets to the sweet spot of the baseline. 23. But we said this. At the end of the first half, we said the fact that the Warriors had fought to stay in the game, didn't let the Raptors run away with it, is quickly knocks down. The representative is ready to help you right now. What do you do in the fourth quarter? Can you make any pay here? Hartman open three, and he bottoms it. And that's a nice job to bat that to an open. Score. Let him catch it on the run. The other thing about constantly attacking is you picked up Purple. It's serious now. You got to recognize. It was the left hand that was broken. Shot clock at three. And Jonas great for himself. What a nice take. Bells here and start competing. They played like it didn't sit well. Sense of urgency. Brady Dick with the mid range. Raymond to a cutting Curry to lay it up and in. Perfect. Shot clock at seven. Shot 
Shot clock at three. Steph cut back door, but Trent knocked it away. Trace recognized it and hit it. He knew the buzzer. But it went down. You know, Steve will just wave off a when here on the road. Those fourth quarter turnovers that have bothered the Warriors at times. Quickly three. It's a big miss. The Warriors are a top five defensive team in the NBA with Draymond Green leading the way. After timeout, what do you have? How about Kaminga layup and foul? And it says, why does Steph back screen? Why does that work so well? Steph, no one wants to help off of Steph, and he's a great screener. Takes two defenders. Aaron missing, and Linick had the rebound, but Clay had the good hands. Kaminga changed that shot, got up super high. Oh, Clay three.